position in electrochemical series affect selective discharge. Okay. Now, first of all, we need to know what what is electrochemical series, right? Okay. So this is the two electrochemical series that you need to know in SBM. Okay. Actually, there are more more ions huh, than this in electrochemical series, but uh, in SBM, you just need to know this. Okay. Now, electrochemical series is a list of uh, ions. Okay. A list of ions uh, according to their tendency to receive or release electrons. It's, it's a list of ions and they are arranged in, uh, in such a manner that how easy they receive or release electrons. Okay. So this is the electrochemical series for positive ions and uh, this is electrochemical for negative ions. Eh? Okay. Now let's have a look at the positive ion first. For this uh, positive ions, eh? uh, the higher in electrochemical series, the more electropositive it is. More electropositive means it's easier to form positive ions. For example, potassium. Potassium is easy for potassium to release electrons. Okay, it's easy eh, for it to from potassium atoms eh, to go to potassium ion is easy to is easy. Okay, but it's very hard for potassium ions to receive electrons to become uh, potassium atoms again. When it's higher in electrochemical series, it's easy to release electrons, but it's hard or difficult to receive, to receive electrons. Eh? So it's more electropositive. So the ions at the top of the list is more difficult to be discharged. But as we go down the table, they become easier to be discharged. Okay. So that's the very first thing that you need to know about this electrochemical series. Eh? And during electrolysis, now electrolysis is a process of discharging the ions. Eh? So during electrolysis, the electrode will select those ions which is easy to be discharged. As, as uh, we learned just now, the higher the ions in the electrochemical series, the harder or the more difficult it is to be discharged. And uh, the lower it is, the easier to be discharged. So during electrolysis, they will select those ions which is lower in uh, electrochemical series to be discharged. Okay, so during electrolysis, the ion in the lower position will be selected to be discharged. Okay, just now we have a uh, potassium. Sorry, we have sodium and hydrogens, right? Okay, so sodium and hydrogens, hydrogen is lower. Okay, hydrogen is lower, and therefore hydrogen is selected to be discharged. And at the negative, uh, so at the positive electrode, the negative ions that we have just now is chloride and hydroxide. And hydroxide will be selected to be discharged because it's lower in the electrochemical series. So that is how electrochemical series affect selective discharge. Okay, one more thing. You need to memorize this. So you need to memorize this uh, electrochemical series for the positive and negative ions. I believe, okay, your school teacher have, have taught you how to memorize this. And uh, if you want, actually, you go to you, you go to the internet to search for. There's a lot of this uh, this learning material that teach you how to how to memorize this. So you just find a way to memorize this. But you must memorize it because if you don't memorize, then you don't know which one is higher, which one is lower, right? 